Hi, and welcome to another tutorial on how to get the most out of your Fedora school. This time around, we're going to look at how to add content to your school. Now, the first thing you're going to do is go to the syllabus section of any individual course. And from here, you're going to want to add the content to a given lecture. Now, a quick distinction is the difference between a lecture and a section. A lecture is the individual unit of content where you can put videos, music, text, uh, really whatever you like for students to actually read and engage with to learn the content. Now, a section is just a type of grouping that you can, you know, group individual lectures into and make it somewhat more logical or palatable for someone going through your course. So I'm going to go hit edit lecture right here. And you'll notice that I've already given it a title, a uh, fun lesson. If I wanted to change that, I can be like this, great lesson and just hit enter and it should be fine or click that green check mark button now there are some buttons right here so like video audio text file and pdf there's also a discus attachment which i'll go over a little bit later on but just looking at these main ones all you need to do to add the type of content is just click on it and for instance in the case of video there's an upload video file button right here where you would just drag and drop a video on so I got a sample video right there and it'll take a few seconds to upload the file and once that's done just click add and if you'd like to make this a downloadable file just hit that checkbox before you do so and you should be good to go the next is audio and it's pretty much the same process you click the make it downloadable box if you want uh, you just drag and drop the audio file onto this little perforated box right there in the middle after a few seconds or so it should upload and just hit add afterward to add it as an attachment next is text now you can just directly type on here so to add in some text and what's cool is there are a couple of different options up here for formatting it. So for instance, if I wanted to highlight this first word, I just hit this B right there. If I wanted to italicize the second word, there's this I. And of course, you got to highlight the part that you want to modify. If I wanted to delete something, there's a button like that to strike it through. Or should I say strike through, delete, you just hit the delete button. Uh, you can make an ordered list an unordered list uh, change the indentation uh, you can do alignment add a horizontal line or even add an image in so if you had an image on your computer or a URL you can just put that in drag it there or enter in the URL and hit upload and that would appear next you have a file attachment which is similar to the audio and video attachments you just drag and drop whatever file you want on and that'll make it downloadable for people lastly we have an actual PDF attachment which if you upload a PDF onto it will actually make it so people can view it on the page itself so instead of downloading the PDF and reading it offline on your site they can actually sit there and read the PDF so just click add now what you can also do is you can sort of drag around these items so that you can arrange the order of them and lastly you go back to your syllabus and what you want to do is you want to publish this stuff so publish this draft you'll notice there's a blue draft button next to anything that does have or has not been published so you just want to make sure you do that and lastly what you do is you just hit preview and you just go right here to enrolled user to go to the course itself and preview it as an enrolled user. So once you're on the page, just click start. And you'll notice the title right there, the video, which is made to start automatically. You'll notice a download button right there because I clicked that downloadable box. Here is a window with the PDF itself. Here is that text content I added in. Here is the downloadable file attachment. And at the bottom, of course, here is that audio attachment I added in. Now, like I said before, 
there was that discus attachment. And what that is, is it's a specific type of discussion uh, attachment that you can have on your Fedora school. And in order to enable that, right now, the button's disabled, so you can't use it. But if you wanted to use it, you want to go to the admin dashboard on the school level, go to extensions, and then just hit this toggle right here for discuss. Now it'll ask you for your discuss short name, and if you want to create one, or if you already have one, enter that in. If you don't and you'd like to create one, go to www.discus.com or look at the links below for an article on our support site, which will go into more detail about getting that process set up.